cookies, three dollars a box. Girl Scout cookies, three dollars a box. Girl Scout cookies, three dollars a box. Girl Scout cookies, three dollars a box. Why do you think you'd make good Girl Scout material? Don't look at her. She can't help you. I don't know why you brought her in the first place. But this is a private interview, and I'd like to keep the confidentiality of the Girl Scout code. I'm Roberta Pickle, Miss Spindle's life coach. I don't care if you're a ventriloquist sitting there with your hand up her butt. Do not speak unless spoken to. And while you're at it, try not to breathe so loudly. You sound just like my Aunt Gladys when she's watching Wheel of Fortune. Buy a vowel! Buy a vowel! Why don't they ever listen to me? I told them to buy a damn vowel! Well, Miss Spindlow. Oh, well I love Pat Sajak, personally. Why should the Girl Scouts want you? Do you play a sport? Do you sample in the arts? Have you ever pitched a tent? Well... Oh, <laughs> no. Then what can you contribute? Roxy's trying to reconnect with I'm trying to reconnect with my inner child, and I thought that by joining the Scouts, it would help me to accomplish that. You thought wrong. Girl Scouts means more than just playing My Little Pony by the campfire and gossiping about boys. It builds the character and skills required to succeed in the real world. Um, isn't there a Scout leader I should be talking to? Someone a little... older? She was relinquished of her title as was the rest of the troop. They were smothering my potential and failed to live up to my level of dedication. So you're the last of the Girl Scouts? Make me tell you one more time to close that horrific hole in your head you call a mouth. So, um, what do you contribute to the Girl Scouts, Margo? Well, I earn my merit badges in my sleep and Supreme Cookie Seller might as well be my middle name. Well, that would be a pretty silly middle name. Um, are the merit badges real if you award them to yourself? Are you serious about this or not, Miss Fenway? Oh, yes. Who founded the Girl Scouts of the USA and when? Julia Gordon Lowe, 1912. How many original members? 18 in Savannah, Georgia, now 3.7 million throughout the United States, including U.S. territories, and in over 90 countries worldwide through USA Girl Scouts overseas. Sir. Not bad, Trooper. Bottom line, you're not in until you pass the real test. Real test? Excuse me, ma'am. Would you like to support your local chapter by purchasing some delicious Girl Scout cookies? You're good. Girl Scout cookies, three dollars a box. We're sorry, Mogs. We were being shellfish. Shellfish. Can we come in? We're exhausted from our new jobs. Oh, of course. I'm so happy. Oh, yay. Yay. Oh, man. Oh. Oh, so tired. Oh. So, how are the new jobs going? Hope you're having as much fun as I am. You got a job, too? I'm going to be a Girl Scout. Uh, that's not a job, Moxie. You would think otherwise if you met my scout leader. Are you getting paid? No. Then it's not a job, Moxie. I thought we were supposed to be growing up together. Well, we are. I just need to take this little detour through my childhood. Here we are, working ourselves to death, thinking you're doing the same thing, and that you'd be proud of us for becoming responsible adults. But you've been too busy roasting marshmallows and singing campfire songs. You know I love marshmallows, Mox. I am proud of you. Do you remember when we got drunk and played Chubby Bunny and we <laughs> threw up? <laughs> chubby Bunny, Chubby Bunny, <laughs> Chubby Bunny. <laughs> you don't seem to be taking this as seriously as we are. I think I'm on a much grander mission than you two. If you knew what we went through on a daily basis because of you... Come on, it can't be that bad. I come home every day with my back sore from lying on uncomfortable surfaces and my legs 
the aching from so much squatting. And my arms are just numb from all the pulling and oh, jerking. My neck's twisted from straining. And my fingers have blisters from all the pulling. Oh, and just yesterday, some shot in my mouth. Do you have any idea how gross that tastes? Oh, and then when it comes out your nose, you No. Wait. Yeah, it's yucky. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Uh, I'm working for my Uncle Carl, the plumber. A drain pipe burst yesterday and shot in my mouth. Oh, oh you got a job with your Uncle Carl. Yeah. Oh. What are you doing? Um, um, well, it, it sure um, sounds like you two are trying very hard to impress me. Oh, we are. Really hard. That was never my intention. I'm so sorry that I made you guys feel like you had to do these things for me. I always keep spares. You two know how I'm always losing things. I want you to have them. <gasps> that, well, he said, like, if I quit, that he would find me. I don't know what that means exactly. Oh. He said that. Well, sweetheart, we're just going to have to get you a bodyguard. <gasps> like, like Whitney Houston? <gasps> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I just want to go shopping to celebrate. <laughs> hey, let's go, go. Buy yourself something fabulous. <laughs> I can. I've got to wait for, um, oh, what's her face? You know, the, the snaggle tooth. Um, oh, sorry. my life coach. She's going to help me go for my Girl Scout exam. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, we'll go pick you up something really pretty. <laughs> yes. <gasps> Shouldn't you be under a bridge somewhere eating small children? <laughs> Look what we got. Oh. Look what Max gave us. <laughs> Things are back to normal. Get out of my way. <laughs> you lose, troll. Oh, Herbology Pickle, let me just go get my Girl Scout study guide. It's me. No, I have some bad news. Moxie gave her Twinkle Twitch new credit cards. I don't know, they must have talked her into it somehow. I realize that. What do you Who are you talking to? Boyfriend? <laughs> don't I wish? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, I chortle. You know, I know a doctor I could recommend who could give you a cream, clear that right up. 